Hey guys, Credit Shofu here. It's that time of year again. Christmas is coming and we're going to be going away for a full three weeks back to the UK, uh, back to my hometown. Uh, be sure to share that with you guys. Um, we're going to be taking British Airways Club World Business Class on the 747 to get there. Now the seat we've booked is this middle seat where you get two seats together with an enclosed sort of area with walls around it. Casey Neistat once described it in his video as the best airline seat. I don't know whether it's the best airline seat, but it is pretty cool. Um, after all, British Airways' business class is kind of old as business class products go. It was the first fully flat bed in business class and they haven't really changed it since then. Um, so they are going to upgrade it in a couple of years time. Um, and they're also going to be phasing out the 747 as well. So this could be actually uh, one of the last opportunities we'll get to try out this product. Um, so the 747 British Airways actually is the largest operator uh, of the 747 as a commercial airline. They have like 36 of them still operating and they're going to phase them out by 2024. So it is going to be a little bit nostalgic. It probably will be one of the last times I fly a 747 because at the moment on the routes that I fly, it's generally 777s or 787s. Uh, I rarely get to fly a 747. So uh, it could be the last time I fly one. So for me, it's a little bit of a nostalgia flight. And it's sort of also the fact that uh, I've flown British Airways economy so many times and you always have to walk through Club World and see what you're missing out on. Um, finally, I'm gonna you know, try out that product, even though it may not be quite up there with the world's best business class products. Um, we'll get to try out the uh, British Airways Galleries Lounge at JFK on the way there. Uh, this is a lounge which again, uh, apparently as business class lounges go, it's not the most uh, amazing, uh, but it's reasonable. Uh, and it's a lounge that you can't really access, you can't access through priority pass. You have to either be a British Airways business class passenger or uh, be flying with another airline um, in business class in One World or have One World Elite status uh, to be able to get in. So it's gonna be interesting to check that out. We'll get a lounge review for you guys. Uh, when we get to my hometown, I might give a little bit of a vlog, a little tour uh, of the area, see if, everyone's, uh, see if anyone's interested in that. Some of the hills in the local area were featured in a weird British movie about robots whose heads explode. Uh, but anyway, um, and then on the way back, we'll be checking out the British Airways World Traveler Plus, uh, which is premium economy on the 777. So last time we took it on the 787, this time it's on the 777, which is an older plane. Uh, so we'll be able to, you know, test out which product is better if there's even that much of a difference. Uh, and that'll be on the way back. We're leaving for the UK on Wednesday, so we'll probably upload our first flight review, British Airways Club World, uh, next weekend. Guys, we'd love to know what you're doing for Christmas. Leave your comments below. We'll still be uploading videos to this channel throughout the Christmas period, and I'd like to wish everyone a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Please subscribe if you're new. Hit that notification button so you never miss a video. Give this video a like, and we'll see you in the UK. Bye-bye.